up, YouTube peeps? I'm Seabook96. Those of you that know me, you'll know me as Connor. Hi. Um, recently, as you may know, um, Smosh Games uploaded a video, a Why We're Single video, of their favourite video game music. Um, they covered most of the good ones, Tetris, Mario, Sonic, um, but they, there's a couple that they missed out on, and those are the ones I want to talk to you about today. Um, those, these are my favourite, and that's why I want to talk to you about them. Piggybacking of um, Smosh Games' success, should be fun. Um, first one I want to mention, they already mentioned this one, Halo, obviously. Has, it has one of the best soundtracks ever. Halo 3 especially. Um, the music, the main music, come on. The uh, main menu music, it, you just can't not recognise that as Halo. You hear that, you instantly go, oh, that's Halo. Um, it's just got one of those soundtracks that's completely unique, completely individual. Um, it's There's nothing else like it. It's just the sort of um, the sort of um, choir church thing, because Bungie likes their religious references. Also, they got Breaking Benjamin com coming in to do "Blow Me Away" for the first game. Um, just you just heard the instrumental of it in the background on um, Silent Cartographer. Silent Cartographer, I think it was, and that was awesome. I loved that bit. Um, moving on from Halo, because they already covered that one, Splatterhouse 2. I cannot believe they didn't mention Splatterhouse 2. That has my f my personal favourite and quite possibly the best intro theme ever. Just that, ah, oh, it starts off with your stereotypical horror movie um, choir thing. Choir? No, organ thing. You know, you know Splatterhouse 2, you know Splatterhouse, right? The one with you, where you've got the mask and you punch demons type zombies in half. If you don't know, if you don't know the game, go play it now. Um, if you don't know the theme song or intro song, even it's just awesome. It starts off cool, then it gets absolutely epic as it goes on. It's just one of my favourite intros ever. I absolutely love it. Um, it doesn't sound great because it doesn't sound. Groundbreaking because it's just 60 bit, but yeah, it's just absolutely immense. It's just absolutely awesome and crazy, and I love it. And it really suits the um, Splat House game, where it's just horror, it, the horror based um, demons, zombies type thing. If it wasn't 16 bit, it would probably sound something like this, due to its awesomeness. I think this is what it would probably sound like. It would sound like this if it wasn't a 16-bit game. It's just that awesome, it would just sound this kick-ass. And if you don't think this is kick-ass, you can jump off a cliff right now, because this is absolutely amazing. Unless of course you're not into the rock-type um, scene. Yeah. Big pause. Um, another one I think they really missed out on, and I think needs to be mentioned. Um, the um, Easter egg music from COD Zombies. How did they not mention this? Elena Siegeman has an awesome voice. Elena Siegman, Siegman, whatever, however you pronounce it. The stuff that she came in to do with um, Kevin Sherwood was absolutely incredible. It's exactly the kind of music you want to be killing zombies to. And it's also just good to listen to as well. I, I constantly find myself going back on YouTube just to listen to these songs because they're so kick-ass. Um, yeah. That's pretty much it. That's pretty much my video. Um, my favourite video game music. Yeah. That, uh, fun times. Um, anyway. I have been CPOP96 and I am out.